Does this man know how to fly an airplane or does he know this airplane? He's a recipient of the 2005 Bill Barber Award for Showmanship and the 2007 Art Show Show uh, Showmanship Award, both top honors in the International Council of Air Shows. Kent has an honorary member of the Canadian Snowbirds. What a great job, Kent! Good job, good job, man. staggering 75% of all enemy aircraft at the Yalu River during the war. Fast forward to 4th Fighter Wing to the Vietnam War and after a few more name changes and combat missions, most into the very heart of North Vietnam. So a lot of history right here at Seymour Johnson Airport. It's a lot of proud history and you've got several squadrons that are represented here today that anticipated in World War II, the Korean War, and in Vietnam. The people have been constructed, they fight each other, and it's all sorts of cool stuff. you got to check that out. That's going on in the stand along with a lot of other exhibits. It's really, really amazing. Oh. 
folks in the middle of a real battle. These two pilots caught up the Japanese close to Pearl Harbor and take a field and engaged the Zeros in battle with rounds from the 30 caliber machine guns. However, they quickly ran out. Luckily, they were able to land at Wheeler Fighters look like flying through the 
Stern from the Woodlands, Texas in our 0115. Followed by second generation pilot Patrick Hutchins in 0111. Absolutely beautiful day for the air show, and we hope you're having a great time. 